how's it going guys this is Isaac here and today I'm doing a full review of this Volcano Bluetooth headphones now Volcano is a company that is from China and they do high-end products at an affordable price now they are they also dabble in Bluetooth speakers they also dabble in cameras as well I'm looking forward to getting one of those cameras just to test them out in a review video later on so stay tuned for that one but talking about these Bluetooth headphones they're really quite good but you know with this low price you know it sacrifices in build quality but you know everything else is quite good and you know it's, 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 I give it a thumbs up in terms of how they actually put it together yes if it wasn't plastic it would have been you know a little bit of a higher price than it actually is and they're really quite good in terms of you know sound I'll give you guys a sample of the sound you know a sound test later on so stay tuned for that one now taking a look at these Bluetooth headphones right off the bat you know that you can um, see that the build quality is actually plastic with a little bit of foam on it so it's something that you know you have to deal with and it's not really a deal breaker when you actually get these Bluetooth headphones but one thing that I like about these Bluetooth headphones is that they're really comfortable you can use it for six seven hours in terms of um, really using them if you're going to the gym or you're just running or you're you know you're with your friends or you're just at home listening to music you can listen to it six or seven hours without any problems now also one thing that I want to know that is that you know it doesn't give you that pinch after you know use it for four hours with some cheap Bluetooth headphones these ones are quite decent and I really enjoy and I've used them everywhere since you know I've been using them for about a month since the actual you know unboxing videos that are done on my channel so if you want to check that out I'll put a link in the description now I've been using this micro SD card slot a lot lately and it's really quite good you can switch between FM Bluetooth and the SD card slot seamlessly and it won't give you any much of a problem all you need to do is just switch it on and you know it automatically goes to the SD card slot and plays the music that is on the SD card so it won't really have a problem with that so let me just show you when I switch it on right now because it's off you know um, if the battery this thing just turns blue and it turns green and plays your favorite music when you're actually um, using it so when it's green it's playing your favorite music on the SD card slot so you can easily change and press this bell and we'll go to the FM afterwards you press it again the second time it goes to the Bluetooth side where you can pair it to your phone or to any other device that you have that actually has Bluetooth and what I like about this Bluetooth side is that it has Bluetooth 4.0 so you know you're getting the best quality in terms of the uh, Bluetooth side of these headphones and really it's quite simple and I really enjoy these Bluetooth headphones. I can switch between all of these modes without even having a problem. And I've said that, you know, with the volume and, and volume up and volume down and the fast forward um, and rewind buttons are all in the same place and they all work seamlessly. You long press for the volume and you short press for act the actual uh, skipping of the song. One thing to note that, that when you're actually using it from your phone, when you're watching YouTube videos, it if you press the, the skip button, it automatically skips. But if you're playing music from your favorite music app, like the one that I'm using, like the MX Player now, you know, you'll have to skip it a lot of times before it actually gets to the end of the song. So that's one thing you need to bear in mind. But otherwise, everything else, you know, works pretty well. The call button works amazing. You can answer from your phone or you can answer from here. When you're on the Bluetooth side and it works, it's very clear in terms of hearing the person that is actually, you know, talking to you and you actually talking to them is very clear. So you won't really have a problem with that. Now the pause and play button are in the actual power button. So it's very good overall in terms of uh, these Bluetooth headphones. And I've been using them for about a month now and it's... I mean, I'm very impressed for what this actual Bluetooth headphones have to give for the price range. Now, it's about $20 where, where I actually bought them, but you can get it from Amazon 
and I'll put a link in the description and if you get it, you know, I get a kickback. You know, it's about $24 depending on shipment if you're in the US or in the UK, free shipping. So you won't really have a problem with that. If you're anywhere else in the world, just check how much it costs for shipping and, you know, shipping and handling and you'll see how much that costs overall. But mostly you would pay about $24 or twenty dollars depending on where you're actually living you know it's just that simple i mean you know yeah this is the bluetooth headphones from volcano i would have liked a carry case for this thing but unfortunately it doesn't come with the carry case and um i'm not really bummed about it but you know it's something that you know could have been added you know with these bluetooth headphones but what but with what you get with these bluetooth headphones is something that i really enjoy and I really like. Now looking at the battery, the battery is a lithium battery and you can charge it for about 70 minutes and it will last you a full day. Now the, in the paper it says it lasts for about eight hours, but I've been getting about six, seven hours in terms of uh, music playing and you know enjoying music from my SD card slot. From the Bluetooth side, it's also about six to seven, maybe, five hours you know when you're actually using it you know for the whole day so you you know with moderate use you can last a full day you know with heavy use it lasts you about six to uh, seven hours between day eight hours yeah it can last you if with moderate use you can get up to eight hours or a full day so these are quite good bluetooth headphones where i've seen other bluetooth headphones that can only last for about four hours for the price of these Bluetooth headphones that they come with, they are very good in terms of what Volcano has done. And I really appreciate that Volcano has actually put out these Bluetooth headphones. Another thing that I need to actually note that the headphone jack and the aux cable, the aux cable is not really that good. Um, you know, it's safer if you use the Bluetooth side. The quality is 10 times better than when you're using it, the aux cable. But sometimes the battery dies and you know you don't have you know to any way to charge it. You can just put in the OS cable and it works, you know, quite quite good. But the quality of the audio will drop into, uh, on the OS cable than it would be on the Bluetooth side. So that's something one thing to note when you are using the OS cable rather than using the Bluetooth side of the these um. Um, Bluetooth headphones, it, but it's not a deal breaker. You know, you, you know, you just use it, and then when you get home, you charge it and use the the Bluetooth side, or just play music from your SD card slot. So it's something that you will bear in mind, and you know, it's it's not a deal breaker. And right about now, I'll put in you know the sample test of the sound. This is from my Bluetooth headphones to the microphone on my phone, so it's not going to be you know something that you know is clear for you guys to actually listen to but i'll put it up for you guys to actually listen to for about a minute and you'll be the judge in terms of whether it's good or not
Anyway, this has been Ice and Tech. Um, I just wanted to do a full review of these Bluetooth headphones. I've been enjoying them. I've been using them all the time. And I want to compare them with other Bluetooth headphones once I get them. So when this video does really well, I'll pair them up with uh, other Bluetooth headphones. And I might do a giveaway once I get those other Bluetooth headphones. This has been Ice and Tech. Thank you guys for watching. Make sure to like, subscribe, and press that bell so you can stay notified of my videos. This is i7 Tech and I'll see you guys in the next one.